is going right to that storm drain that the guys are coring and tapping. They're hooking up to a storm drain. They're also running another French drain in the swale. This yard has a swale right here. It was developed that way. It works really well. But inside that swale, it's always soft and spongy. Now, what a storm drain does is it takes care of excess water, meaning if there's standing water in this swale and it can flow to the storm drain, that storm drain will take it in. What the storm drain can't do and what it won't do is dry out the yard. It's going to get rid of the bulk water, but all the water in the soil, it's going to stay saturated. Hauling away all that clay, putting in a couple of perforated pipes with stone, and of course wrapping them in a good non-woven geotextile filter fabric is going to allow us to pull the water from the subsurface, because remember this only does the surface, but when you drill through the side of the concrete catch basin and you tap it, that's why we call that a core and tap. We core it, and we go ahead and we hydraulic concrete a pipe that we can connect to. The guys did a beautiful job. We used a female connector. It holds really, really well. 